What's up guys, it's Ray and Jeff from AchievementHunt.com. <laughs> a little delay in the intro, leaving that in. Call of Duty Black Ops 2 Happy Hour Achievement Guide. Happy Hour is something I know a lot about. So that's from like... Because you're such a big drinker. One forty-five to 3.30. I don't know why it's called Happy Hour. <laughs> Weird hours. In the AM, by the way. So for this achievement, you have to buy two uh, of the power-up drinks. Okay. Without turning on the power, which... In other Call of Duties, is impossible because you need to turn on the power to get electricity to turn the machines, blah, blah, blah. Makes sense to me. But what you saw there is I grabbed a mannequin and I put it on a crafting bench thing. Oh, yeah, the buildable bench Yeah, things? it's yeah. very odd. Oh, this is new to zombies where if you find uh, materials around the uh, the area, you can put it on a bench and they make something. So what I'm making here with... Uh, Looks uh, like to me you're making dead zombies. I'm making dead zombies, yes. You, uh, the reason I'm killing the zombies there is because you need, you still need the points to buy the actual drinks themselves. Okay. So I, I got the mannequin. I got like a, a tail thing there, like from a plane. And the other thing I need is a fan, which is behind me. So you're building an energy drink out of a fan and something well, the, from a plane <laughs> and a mannequin. The drinks are still there. I'm just building a turbine or a generator to uh, turn on the machine without having to turn on the power. Ah, I gotcha. So I'm just racking up points here because, like I said, you still need points or money or whatever to buy the actual drinks themselves. Mm -hmm. So here's the last piece. Building, building. It's how you build things, by the way. Just make movements <laughs> with your hands, and Poppy you're done. Knuckles. Then you grab it. This is a turbine, so it's on your uh, little D-pad thing there. Sure. It's up on the D-pad. Get this guy out of the way in his uh, onesie. Then uh, <laughs> make sure you grab the quick revive here, which is on by default, which is always on, on single player. I'm doing a single player. With multiplayer, you have to uh, turn it on. Okay. So you see right there, it's like, I need a source of power. Boosh, there's my source of power. That's <laughs> Don't know what that is. It opened the door, so I'm going to pick that up again. You can pick... Uh, uh, the zombies can destroy it, so you gotta watch out for that. But uh, you can use it as many times as you want because you built it, so it's yours forever. So I got quick revive. That's one. Now I'm gonna hop on the bus here. This is the interesting part of the the DLC. Okay. Or not the DLC. The zombies is uh, you get around on this zombie bus, whatever, with a robot driver. Makes sense to me. It takes about 15 minutes to get from location to location. That's not true, like six, but it's like, come on. What what do you what do you just listen to the radio while it happens? Yeah, or? and sometimes zombies attack you and stuff, so mm. it's uh. You know, a little boring, but at least they try and keep it interesting. Now you want to take the bus all the way to the barn, which is the third location. The second area is a diner. Bypass that. Go up these stairs. Don't buy that gun, Ray. Uh, come up these stairs, and there is a, a double tap here. Okay. Lay down your fucking turbine, and you, you see it turns it on. <laughs> I pick it up like an idiot. I'm like, why isn't it on? <laughs> so, don't do that. Leave it on. This costs 2,000 uh, points, I guess. Sure. Which is the reason why uh, you were killing the zombies before. Drink it up. Boom, that is your second uh, drinky drink, and you will get the happy hour achievement for 10 gamer score. All right. So there you go. <coughs> there, there is something in the diner. Are you okay over there, Jeff? Do you need happy hour right now? I, I, I almost, I, yeah. Okay, well, there you go.